All right, so this is ADW Launcher. You'll notice uh, that it looks kind of just like the default Froyo Launcher uh, with the dock down here. Uh, if you open up the app drawer, you'll see that it's transparent. It's got some 3D effects. Um, as a result, it's kind of uh, a little bit slower than some of the other launchers I've experienced, although this varies from person to person. Uh, you'll also see that uh, you can customize the number of uh, apps in a row, which is pretty nice. You can kind of crunch them all together. It does have its own settings. Uh, if you open it up, you can do the usual things like customize how many home screens you want, um, things like that. You can also customize how many apps are in a, every column and row on the home screen, which is nice if you want to just fit a lot of apps in on each screen. So that's pretty nice. Uh, if we go back into the settings, uh, it has these cool swipe actions that uh, basically, if you swipe up, it'll hide the menu bar. If you swipe down, uh, you can bring down the notification bar instead of having to go all the way to the top of the screen. Um, and you can assign these to pretty much any action you want, like going to the home screen, showing you a preview of all your home screens. Uh, it's pretty convenient. The other really big part of ADW is themes. Um, you can go download themes from the market for, you know, they're usually free to about a dollar. Um, this one's probably not one of my favorites, but it does a really good job of showing kind of what it can do. It will theme your, all the UI settings. It will change all of the icons, completely change the look of your screen, which is nice. Um, so you'll see that all these are kind of, you know, pencil drawings of different apps. Um, and if we open up the app drawer, we'll see that it doesn't just theme the apps that come on your phone. Some popular apps like Adobe Reader or Barcode Scanner are also themed. Um, so, you know, a lot of your apps will still fit in with your theme and your screen won't look confused. Um, overall, it's really, it has probably the most configuration options of any launcher out there. Um, so if you really, really want to customize your experience, ADW is a good one to try. Um, but it does have some performance issues for some people, so you might just have to try it out.